Don't you know now? Okay. All right, everybody. Okay. I reached 637 subscribers. I have to say thank you. I don't know what I'm doing differently, but I'm doing something freaking amazing. And I don't know what it is, but thank you so much for the subscribers. I swear to God on my life. I wish I could take a lying detector test on somebody sit here with me. I'm really, really appreciative that I got 600 and something subscribers. I, I don't know what I'm doing differently, honestly. Um, but thank you so much. I really appreciate you guys. I've been trying to post off and on. It's just, I just haven't had time to constantly take up. So I'm kind of out of breath because I just got back in from shopping. Sorry. Um, thank you. Uh, I don't know. Words can I express? You know, people, you know, when you first get on YouTube, you don't know what to expect. You don't know if people are going to like you. If people are going to be judgmental. If people are going to just talk crap. That's 90% of YouTube. Um, but I have been very fortunate that I've had very few, except for a, a stalker here and there that, you know, that, that is a, a pain in the butt. But he's gone now, thank God. No, I haven't been bothered in a long time. Um, oh, speaking of cool stuff that I got, um, I got a cool hat. Everyone knows this hat, right? I love this hat. I wear it almost all the time. I have another fedora. Um, Michael Jackson, very style. I love I love fedoras and I love hats and I love, I have OCD composure with these types of styles of hats. And so I went to Metro Park, which is this store, sorry, and they wrapped up my favorite hat and they had a new one, ha, a brand new one. And this one's a little bit more sturdier than this one. This one's like this really weird clothy material that isn't very durable, but it's like the same style and it is and I'm just so excited, see? I have two different hats. Um, it reminds me of Spy vs. Spy. Remember those hats from Spy vs. Spy? Um, but that's that's cool. Um, thank you, guys. Uh, what what else am I talking about? Oh, the music. I swear to God, I know I've been saying, you know, the music's coming, the music coming. I'm just giving you guys stuff that's given to me. The music sounds so much better. It was sent back. It was sent back. The, uh, the panelists didn't like it. My producers it kept, you know, pushing. We kept pushing the music, and we kept getting better and better and better. And the music, I've inc incorporated a lot of live instruments. It's not just synthy stuff. It's not just dance stuff. This stuff, it, the music that I did, I would consider it rock dance, if that makes sense. Uh, rock dance. Um, it's real drums, real guitar, real bass, and uh, synths, and and everything added to it. So you could just kind of throw call this a throwback new style dance music. Um, I'm very proud of the music. I really, really, really am. I worked really hard the past couple months. Actually, two years. It's literally two years. I had set, but anybody who's been following me from the beginning knows that it's been a setback after a setback after a setback. But we are officially um, rocking and rolling away with the music. So I'm pretty excited about it. I'm very grateful for the music. It sounds amazing. There's really... You know, nothing to say other than I can't wait to bring the music to you guys and showcase it and get the live show. Clark Abbott, I'm very sad that you won't be joining me on guitar. I really, really am devastated because you are an unbelievable guitarist. People have seen my video on Facebook, my friends and subscribees. No, uh, Clark Abbott is an, is an amazing, 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 amazing guitarist. He, um, he does really good stuff. So now I'm in the market to look for a new guitarist. And I heard if, you know, on YouTube, if you guys know of a guitarist that li possibly lives in California, preferably in San Francisco, who can go to the uh, rehearsal space and uh, talk about, uh, you know, just get involved, who is a people person. I'm not looking for somebody who's ego driven and thinks about themselves and is all, I just want somebody who's fun, eccentric, gets along with everybody. I don't care if you're black, white, Puerto Rican, Chinese. I don't care. As long as you have a good disposition in life and you're really fun and you're eager to play and you can play not just cover songs but are able to play real guitar, have at least five plus years experience and have performance experience live with people, that would be great. 
I know uh, somebody was suggested to me, and they said, oh, my nephew is amazing, and the kid cannot play literally. He's like two, three chords, and I felt bad because, you know, you should be realistic with your with your friends and family. So um, I'm looking for a badass guitarist, male, female, I don't care. Um, and that, yeah, that on that front. So if you know anybody, please message me, send them, send their info, information my way. Um, it's a beautiful day in San Francisco today. It's sunny, it's gorgeous, it's gonna be raining tomorrow, which I prefer the rain and cold and gray, but anyways. Uh, you guys might notice I wear a lot of purple, aren't I? <laughs> uh, it's my favorite color. It's always, it's always been my favorite color. Um, I'm working on, oh, I need suggestions because during my live show, if you guys don't know, I'm a big Michael Jackson fan. Uh, Michael Jackson influenced my popping and locking. And um, so, like, I'm all trying to think of a Michael Jackson song that I can do to give him justice um, because I want to cover. I've always, since I was a child, uh, Mick Thompson, which is a choreographer who worked with me, worked with MJ. Um, before MJ passed away, I was po potentially going to meet him. It was like an 80% chance that I was going to meet him because Dylan. Uh, Liddell is Michael Jackson's choreographer was so I was very 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 disappointed very devastated so but I'm going to do a tribute uh, song to him so you guys tell me which song su a song suggestion of Michael Jackson that you guys would like to hear that would be so amazing um yeah crap I don't know what else to talk about thank you guys have a wonderful afternoon have a good, good, restful Sunday. Um, oh, one second. I went to Whole Foods the other day, or I call it Whole Paychecks, um, and I bought this right here. And I know what you're thinking. I know what you're thinking. That pancake batter in a can sounds disgusting. It doesn't sound very nutritional. But I have to say, this pancake mix from Whole Foods is amazing. And I've tried tons of this type of stuff. All of it sounds tasted weird, artificial, fake, gross. This is so amazing. I had like seven pancakes already today. That should tell you that this is amazing. Usually after one use of these things, I'm like, Whoa, throw it away. I'm gonna order, I'm gonna take like 10 of these. I'm gonna buy the store out of these because this is so freaking good, amazing. Um, I bloody love this thing. Um, oh, and also, for my, my fellow Aussie Brits and New Zealanders, ha, Marmite. Everybody should eat this because it's salty goodness in a can. <laughs> Anyways, guys, have a good afternoon. Love you guys. Peace.